students coming to the next topic in the subject microprocessor unit is programmable internal timers so the pin uh, numbers for this uh, uh, programmable internal timer is intel a253 or a254 so this is a internal timer device which is connected to the microprocessor whether it is an 8086 microprocessor or 8085 microprocessor so the main uh, it is designed this programmable internal timers is designed for microprocessor to perform to perform timing and counting functions so the main use of this programmable internal timer is to perform timing and counting functions using three 16 bit regis registers so with the help of this three 16 bit registers uh, this a253 or a254 is to perform timing and counting functions that are uh, uh, used for the microprocessor so here each counter so i said there are three uh, 16 bit register counters is there so each counter has two inputs input pins so there are three counters that are present in this 8253 or 8254 uh, internal timers uh, for each counter there are two inputs so the two inputs that are clock and gate so one is the clock and next is the gate and one output pin it is having one output pin okay so that is uh, out out pin next to operate to operate a counter a 16 bit count is loaded loaded in its registers so to operate this counting circuit so a 16 bit count is loaded in its register so let us first see the difference between 8253 um, programmable internal timers 8253 and 8254 later that we will see the features of this uh, PT pits so first let me explain the difference between difference between 8253 and 8254 so based on the usage we can go for 8253 or 8254 so let first tell me 8253 and 8254 now let us see so 8253 uh, its operating frequency is the first difference is 8253 operating frequencies frequency is in between 0 to 2.6 megahertz so this frequency ranges from 0 to uh, 2.6 megahertz and whereas 8254 the operating frequency is the operating frequency is in the range between 0 to 10 megahertz so when compared to this 8253 8254 operating frequency is more okay so based on the requirement of the user we can go for 8253 timing and counter register or 8254 timing and counter register and next it uses this 8253 chip uses nmos technology nmos technology whereas 8254 uses hmos technology hmos technology and next uh, next difference here 8253 is uh, read back command so whatever a read and if you want you can again call that the read back command is not available in 8253 so once it read you cannot uh, back the information means read back command is not available there in 8253 whereas in 8254 read back command is available so by seeing the difference it is somewhat advantage uh, means uh, advanced features for 8253 when compared to uh, 8254 is having more adva advanced features when compared to 8253 and the fourth difference is here 
in 8 to 5 the read and writes so of writes so of the same counter same counter cannot be interleaved cannot be interleaved so whatever the read and write operations are performed that the same counter cannot be interleaved whereas in 8 to 5 4 read and write uh, writes of the same counter of the same counter can be interleaved interleaved so this is the difference between 8253 and 8254 now let us see the features of this uh, programmable timing and control uh, counter so programming internal timer counters so now let us see the features the features of programmable internal timers pits 8253 or 8254 so both is having the same features but only the based on the usage of your uh, based on the configuration of uh, the chip you can select either 8253 or 8254 now let us see the features it has three independent so i already said it has three uh, counter 16 bit registers will be present which are used for counting functions so it has three independent 16 bit down counters we call it as a down counters and next it can handle dc to 10 megahertz so it can handle means that is from 0 to it can handle from dc to 10 megahertz operating frequency and it has the th i said it is having a three counters uh, that can be programmed those three counters can be programmed program for either binary or bcd count so those three counters can be programmed uh, either for binary or binary coded decimal count and next feature it is compatible with almost all microprocessor it is compatible with almost all microprocessor so whether that uh, whatever it may be 8 to 8086 so it can compatible with almost all microprocessor and uh, this 8254 whatever i said 8254 has powerful has powerful read back command whereas 8253 doesn't have read back command and and 8254 is having a powerful read back command why we use this read back command which allows which allows the user to check the count value so to check the count value we will use the read back command so whatever the information that the processor is able to read from the uh, read with the help of this uh, internal timing circuits the counter circuit so this read back command is useful to allow the user to check the count values and the next uh, the program mode and uh, not only the count words uh, so not on, only the count values and also the program mode so whatever the program mode that is operating this internal timer uh, that program mode and the current mode current mode and the current status current status of the counter so everything will be checked by with the help of this read back command so 8254 has a powerful read back command which allows the user to check the count values the programmed mode the current mode and the current status of the counter so this is about the uh, features of 8253 and 8254 so in the next video i'll explain uh, what is this programmable internal timers with the help of the pin diagram and the architecture thank you